We're going to get the pusher one back up in the air. Uh, today we're going to try a 5x5 five five, uh, prop. So this should make this thing pretty fast. This is supposed to be the fastest prop for this motor without going a little bit overboard, uh, which I've done before and that's why we burnt up PSCs. So uh, this should be safe. This should actually be a great for, prop for this and actually give us really good fly times. But I'm hoping it'll also push this thing 90 miles an hour or more. Um, I did some modifications since the last video. I made new fins for the back. Um, they're longer, they're about two inches longer, so I'm hoping that'll give us a little bit more stability over the short fins that I had back here. So that does make the plane about two inches longer. So I'm hoping since it's a pair longer, then it will be a little bit more stable. Um, but we have the new insanely fast prop on here, and we're just gonna see how it goes. Hopefully, this has much less thrust than the other prop that I was running, which is the 7x4. So what I'm going to have to do is when I hand launch this, I'm probably going to have to give it pretty close to full throttle so I can make sure it has enough thrust to get in the air. And then we'll just see how it goes. Um, if this doesn't have enough thrust, I'll, I have a 6x4 that I plan on running from now on. It won't be quite as fast, but it'll still be faster than the 7x4. Um, and it'll be more efficient as well, so I'll probably run that. But for now, I want to see how fast this thing will go with our Speedo taped to the front. Let's see. We're going to chuck it up here. There's a... Okay. One of those, uh... Oh, let me just... Tiny prop does seem to work pretty well. Let's see how fast this thing goes. It definitely, it definitely moves. I'm not sure if it's faster or slower. I feel like it, because it definitely does have a lot less thrust, it, uh, it may be a little slower. I don't know. It's definitely more stable with these new fins though. I can tell like right off the bat, it's way more stable with the new fins. Seems like it's way faster. It's doing good in this wind. We have a good amount of wind today. I'm not sure if you guys can see by the video some of the trees are moving around, but this thing is so much more stable with these new fins. We have plenty of time to do quite a few speed runs, but I'm uh, I'm definitely interested to see how fast this goes. So I'm gonna do one more pass, and then we're gonna get it down. Okay, one more. Having a lot of fun. sucker down and hopefully come in for a smooth landing. Oh. 
Oh. Just barely caught that. Yeah, hopefully, uh, hopefully the How fast, sir? How fast do you think it's going? Uh, I, mean, I don't know. I'll, we'll see. I'm going to say... Like it's, it's around 80. 91, I'm going to say. Oh, 75. We actually Dang. lost speed. So oh. I wondered that because maybe we just didn't have the thrust. I don't know. It looks like you ripped off. That's ah, all right. That's just a little landing gear we don't need. Um, so we actually lost a little speed, but we gained stability. So 75 miles an hour. So still pretty gonna, dang fast. I think because we lost thrust. Um, this is only about 750 grams of thrust and the plane weighs around 650 and maybe we just need more thrust. So I'm going to put the six by four on here and see what happens.